Fresh air. Yes. Yes. <laughs> What's good, London? We are in shortage right now, I'm about to meet a guy called Brandon, but he runs a really, really cool fashion lifestyle vlog called Wall Street Paper out of New York, and we really dig what he does. If you would have watched our last video, you know that this guy lost the challenge. So today is no. the day that he owns no. up to the challenge Come on, last. No. And I got a little special surprise. We're Man. taking it back to our grassroots today. So. Before Come on, I guy, dude, shut up, cool shut guy. up, shut up, he's shut cool up. Guy. A few moments later. Oh, they're oh my god! <laughs> yes, yes. Look at him. degrees. You know how warm this thing is. That's exactly why I chose that jacket, man. Couple of rules for this outfit today. More rules. Rule. Rule number one: You cannot take off the jacket or hat at any time throughout the night. You always have to be wearing this outfit no matter what. Rule number two, if any of the boys from New York ask you about your outfit or why you're wearing this jacket or hat inside, you cannot tell them you lost the bet or the challenge. You have to tell them that it's a part of your style and it's the look you have for tonight. I look like an idiot. Exactly, because these guys are stylish motherfuckers who have good taste and good fashion sense and you look like this. All right, let's do this. I'm pissed. Just want to be out and meet cool people, but someone is probably gonna punch you in your face because you look like a. F so we started. This is Brandon. Brandon, say hello. Hello. So Brandon's blog is Wall Street Paper on Instagram and WallStreetPaper.com. Super cool blog. Make sure you check him out. Jens's blog does not exist because he's got <laughs> shit style. It ain't easy being disagrees. <laughs> can't even say it. I mean, you've been here for what, 48 hours now? A little bit over 48 hours. What's your uh, impression of London? Man, my impression is London has just a lot of history. Like, New York has history, but it, it only goes back so far. Like, London, you can go to a spot that's like early 1700s before the US. True. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. The, the history, the architecture, um, I, I'm a real fan of all of the accents. Those are like, super like the dope. British accent. I'm very, I'm a very fan of all you tings out there. Holler at Brandon. <laughs> First place we're taking Brandon is Dinarama. It's owned by Street Feast, and it's like, yes. like street style food all in one place. Super, super dope. dope. Super, super, super dope. dope. There we go. Hey Pete, this looks interesting. What did you get? I got yum bun. This is a portobello mushroom yum bun and this is a chicken, chili flakes and like some kind of yogurt dressing on the side. Yum bun, what's, what's good? What's good? Mama jeez. What did you get? The tandoori chicken burger has been marinated for 48 hours. Just the smell, my mouth saliva is having an orgasm right now. <laughs> into your heart it kind of melts in your mouth say hi guys welcome to London are you guys crazy yeah. you crazy yeah. <laughs> you I need to add something alright you know what I'm saying uh, what's good about uh, you know everything that's going on yeah, what's, what's you know, this, this situation, what, what is this, what's good with this situation right here? You cannot tell them you lost the bet or the challenge. You have to tell them that it's a part of your style and it's the look you have for tonight. I look like an idiot. In front exactly. Of them. This is my style. This is what I do. You know, like you see me, you ask people, what does Jens usually wear? And this is what he wears all the time. I wear this like four to five times a week. And people see me and they're like, oh, you that one guy. Yeah. But I want people to be like, I know this motherfucker. Exactly. <laughs> I am really fucking warm. Like, someone made me wear this. You have to tell them that it's a part of your style. No, and I can't take it off for the whole night. Is he bothering you? It says comedy value. I rock this. I think you rock him. Do you like his style? Good about myself right now. <laughs> Anyone else hot right now? <laughs> wow, 
Mr. Papa Giorgio. I've been getting so much love out here. So much love. <laughs> Bro, like asking me left and right. Like, yo, uh, yo, I like yo, your Papi. style. What's going on? Papi, this can one I... guy comes to me, goes, yo, dude, I'm digging your style. Can I take a photo with you? No. He goes on Instagram. Then he goes, oh, I'm a model, man. I like what you guys do. Oh, <laughs> shit. And then he starts following us in his voice, too. Uh, Brandon, on a scale from 1 to 10, how do you like my outfit? Oh, man. I mean, I'm at about 4.5. Oh, what? I've been Common getting mad projects. props. Common Projects Resort saved you. Show him those Common Projects. All right, all right, with your fucking Common Yo, Projects. But show the Kohan. Get the Kohans in there. Get all the right, Kohans. all right, all right. I got the Kohans. I'll give you an honorable mention 10. Uh, honorable mention. Okay. On a scale from 1 to 10, what do you think about the vibe, the energy here? Yo, the vibe and energy, scale-wise, definitely had a team. I felt like I was in New York, but over the pond. Like, literally, I was like, wow, there's so much culture, there's so much interaction, there's so many amazing people, and there's such a Got this lamb burger with, like, fried onions on top, with mas tiki masala, tiki masala. fries. Was it banging? Yeah. It was banging. 10? 10. 10. 10. 10. 10. 10. Do you think Dinarama is what's good? Good. Dinorama is definitely what's good. It's more than what's good. I'm coming here every time I go to London. All right, you heard okay, it, you heard you it. Heard it. Dinorama definitely hey, what's, good. what's good. What do you think of his style? I absolutely love it. I love the cake. Really? Oh my God, I'm so, I'm shocked. <laughs> you should touch it. <laughs> I will touch it. It's real firm. Yeah. Damn it, this isn't working. This isn't, real this isn't working. It was supposed this to be challenge, funny. This challenge backfired this on backfired. your Peter's son. This is backfired. Everyone is giving me mad props. <laughs> oh, oh, payback is going to be a bitch ah. and I'm going to make sure that you look like a We promised you yes. to take you to some cool spots after dinner. So we're taking you to Discount Suit Company. I'm feeling the bar. The drinks are cool. The music is good. What I'm not feeling is I am so warm. <laughs> it is hot. I could be sitting in a sauna right now. Check this out. I'm sweating. Oh, okay. I'm a pig. It's not fun. It's not fun. I just want to take this off and shower. Fresh air. Yes. Yes. Oh, this feels so good. You have no idea. It was so warm in there. It's still warm outside. But I can't take it off. Not yet. Can I take it off, Peter? Song? No! <laughs> Even I'm hot. I'm sweating. And it was hot as hell in there. And this guy, I gotta give it to you, bro. You're a trooper. You fucking, you rocked that thing in that 30 degree heat score. Uh, and you rocked it like a champion. So good on you for continuing the challenge. Mad respect. Respect, bro. Respect. Look at this. Look at this tree. Deadness. Crazy dead. You would not expect such a cool spot for a cocktail bar in between Allgate East and Spitterfields Market. I love this place, hidden gem. Come here! True. Yes. The drinks are really good. The cocktails are off the charts. You will like this place. Guys, I really think that this place... Wait, wait, wait you wait, wait. think? We think. We think? Yes. This place is... What's good? We love the energy of Shortage and want to show you guys our favorite spots. If visiting or if you're local, follow this itinerary for a hell of a good time. <laughs>